Hi guys, I'm Asif Ali, you're watching this job video. Today we will make this cool bubble material in Unreal Engine very quickly. So let's start this tutorial. So let's start this. So in Unreal Engine 5.5, I have this map with this sphere and an empty material. So let's make this translucent and I'll use default lit and single sided. And here I will use volume. So all the features will be available. Now, first thing I'll take the thumbnail. And if I preview that, this is how it looks. I'll make this value one. So the gradient will be proper. And then what I'll do, I'll take a three vector. Let's make this uh, red. And then if I take the hue and inside hue, I'll use that as a texture. And then in the shift, because that shift makes uh, red color in different values. So I'll put this funnel and now it will give you this thing. You can just directly connect it in opacity and this thing here. And if I turn this off, this is how it will look. And then what I'll do, I'll make the full roughness and specular. This is how it looks. This looks already cool. So next thing is I'll just multiply it with like little value 0.2 and connect it to emissive. And now this ring of color is very like uh, same every side. So what I'll do. And you can also make this color maybe green so that gradient will be cooler. So you can take the noise texture if you have like this. If I take this noise and directly connect it uh, into the funnel here. Okay. But this will make these kind of thing because of the UVs. So and first of all, I'll just copy and paste this and connect this here. I'll use separate for the color and separate for the opacity. And if you don't want this thing here, so you can just take the noise. And if I, you need to make the same, same kind of noise. So I'll just preview this. Maybe 0 0.002 and I don't need turbulence and maybe 0 to 1 and less levels. Let me check how it looks. Looks fine. Maybe I'll make 0.2. Because it has very subtle values. Yeah, it looks similar. Now I can use this thing here or you can just mask and then single channel and connect this here. Cool. But I'll make the dialing a little big. So you have to check the values. And then the next thing is what I'll do. I'll take this noise and I'll just animate it first. So for animation, I'll take the world position and multiply with the time actually multiply your time with and then add it on world position and maybe i'll use 50 connect this here it should be animated now and now you can just multiply it with vertex normal and then multiply it how much you want like 50 and connect this here you can see you can decrease the tiling. Then the last thing is you can just go here and check the refraction and turn on this refraction and you can just take a LARP, use the same noise. You have this and maybe I'll just make it one and maybe five and connect it here and let's check it. So I'll just save it and I'll just apply it on here. Color looks same. So we have to figure that out. So this thing. I will just let me preview that. Maybe I'll make this point five. Yeah, so you have to find out cool, good values, and that's it. So I'll just make some values for instance, like refraction. I'll make it three by default. Then this is distort three. Then WPO. This is 50. And then this color. I'll save it. And if I make an instance of this and apply this here and open. Now with these values, like I can increase the distortion if I want this much and then this is how much distortion i want in color and then i don't want that color to be very saturate so i will desaturate a little bit and then 
how much WPO you want. So this looks really cool bubble. And of course you can duplicate and change materials. Thanks for watching. Keep learning. Bye-bye.